I will never fully understand the disappearance of Brandon Swanson. So Brandon had just finished up his freshman year of college out in Minnesota, and he attends a party on the evening of May 14th, 2008. He's reported to have left the party sometime around midnight and heads to his family home, which is about 30 miles away, and for an unknown reason, he takes a back road. But at some point on this drive, his car ends up in a ditch, so he calls his parents to come pick him up, but he has to give them very specific instructions because, again, he's on a back road. But by the time they get there, they can't find him anywhere, so he gets back on the phone with them, and he says he thinks he can see their car lights in the distance, so he's gonna get out, he's gonna walk to them. He stays on this call for 40 minutes just walking through the dark towards this light and then unexpectedly interrupts himself and just yells, oh shit. These were the last words his parents had ever heard from him. It's believed Brandon was actually 25 miles away and despite search efforts, he has never been found and no one knows what it is that he saw. 